Hey guys, it's Taylor from The Extra. I wanted to go ahead and do a tutorial on my bubble braid. Um, so I've gotten a lot of questions and a lot of comments about this for you guys wanting this done. So the way I do this is that I start off with these nearly invisible teeny tiny elastics. So because my hair is so thick, I use two for each bubble. So you're gonna start by, well, first of all, brush your hair. Um, but then you're going to pull all of your hair over to one side, whichever side you want, um, kind of get it together, the front and the back. You don't want any stray hairs on this. So, and then you're going to just knot it right here behind your ear. And again, I use two of these ties at a time because my hair is so thick, but if you have thinner hair, you can just use one. So get your next round of elastics out. And for this next one, you're gonna wanna go about an, I would say probably two to three inches below and just do another loop like this. And really the trick to this is you pull out like this and you pull forward. See that creates this nice little bubble and you kind of just play with it like that. See? And then you really, you just keep doing this um, until you get your desired length um, or your desired bubble. Um, I typically do about four or five of these. But again, it's just going to depend on your hair length and um, how much hair you have. I have a ton of hair, so I can go, <laughs> I can pretty much keep going on this. So I'm going to finish this out for you just so you can see how it looks. Um, but again, the biggest thing is that you can't just leave these bubbles like this and then just be, and then try and like make it big this way. You have to pull forward. That's what gives it the bubble. This also works a lot better if your hair is dirty. So um, I actually do this when my hair is dirty and I need to wash it. It's just um, kind of one of those tricks that I use so that people can't really tell how dirty my hair is. Um, and again, like I kind of will sit and mess with it and try and make the bubbles better. I'm not in front of a mirror right now. I'm just doing this on my phone. Um, but again, the biggest thing is to pull these bubbles forward to get that huge bubble look that you want. And that's it. So I hope that you enjoyed this. Um, and please check out my website. It is www.theextrablog.com. Uh, check it out for more hair tips, beauty tips, and more. Thanks.